should be live about now. Hey guys, thanks for watching. This is the final part to the uh, Isle of Armor playthrough. Isn't that right, dude? We've got two to support here. And, uh, yeah, so last time we did not beat the Psychic spar and it's the last one we have to do other than that we have the battle with honey and technically i also should battle her again as i've not done that post game um i don't believe so um i did learn a important thing that is uh, the power herb uh that i've been using for the boost um, in the main game actually breaks after a use. So, um, unfortunately one of those is gone. But, and here, and in ranked and all that stuff, doesn't do that. Um, and we need to change Star Means X. So, this is my team. I've, I've gotten them to level 100. Uh, which thanks to the Lucky Egg and XP candies didn't take too long. Um, what was I giving him? I don't know if I had something specific for them, but let's just do C sets. Um, then I'll check real quick if there was anything specific. I believe it was just that, or was it this? It was this. Yeah. There we go. Okay. And then this. Uh, well, here. There really should be a way to check what the items do. I think there is. If I go to Pokemon Box, check held item, uh, check summary. I am held by super effective moves. So we're going to put Gardevoir out first. We've got our attack set. We just need to heal and then go into spars. Get that done. We'll have two battles after that. And then um yeah, we'll be done with Isle of a Oh, and I've... Here, let's do that first. Let's do that first. Because um, I believe I... Well, I haven't caught every Diglett on stream. I believe I have gotten every reward on stream. And earlier, I did get the last of the Diglets, But I did not turn them in yet. So let's see what that is. I, the only one I might have missed was 100, which was the Jin seven starter um which coincides with whatever type you picked in here so because i went with sobble i got poplio all 151 came back and now we get the first sticklet we found And I don't know if there's any rewards for that, or like any perks to having this Diglett. Um, it was just added to party. Oh, okay, so it's a max stat Diglett. That would have been good for our steel run. But yeah, so... That's what you get from all the Diglets. Also, I've still not completed the Pokedex. Maybe I can do that at the end if this is going pretty short. Because all I have to do, I have all the Pokemon. I just need to put them in the daycare and pull them out because of the bug that's currently in the game. Um, but before that, let's go ahead and spar. 
Alright. We've never gotten past round four. But today is the day. Today we will get past it. With two stews held. It's gonna take. Alright. I think that's both good and bad. If we can take them out on hit, it's good. Oof, okay. Is that do again? That's fine. Oh, that's not good. But you have to kill yourself for it. Okay. Looks right. And our attack goes down farther. Okay. Let's see Max Mindstorm. Wow, that really lowered our special attack. Okay. But with the terrain boost. We might get lucky. This should knock him. Also, with the wild charge here. That was actually our third turn Dynamax. Please have something that's weak. This sharp. Is Steel weak to Fairy, or is Fairy weak to Steel? I always forget which matchup that is. Um, maybe neither, but Steel seems to be weak to Psychic, or no, other way around. And that's gonna be it for Gardevoir. So Exeggutor wasn't maxed last time, neither them, and I switched out Solrock for Starmie, um, but neither of them were maxed out. Um, apparently his special attack was decent, even though it was like nearly 300. So with that hyper trained, his special attacks are phenomenal. And then I used some EV vitamins to um, get him up to uh, get his speed up, which has actually turned out very well. Um, so I think that balances Excure to where we needed him last time and didn't have him. And then Starmie isn't best psychic, but they are one of, if not the fastest. That's really what we need in a third, um, third spot. Someone that can attack first every time. Uh, we'll, we should actually be able to still attack first uh, but the, or not, or they'll use Trick. And now we have the Flame Orb. Great. Oh, it's a healing round. I don't like not having the glasses, though. Dial. I think they're weak to water. Yeah. But their speed is still faster. It's a special defense to rise. Alright. Nice. 
we got one more to go. Still got two pokes. That was our last Gigantamax, or Dynamax Molga. That is not a good Pokemon choice for us. But we should be good. Oh, wait. Right the part flying. As long as we can survive, which the Starmie's health is actually, or defense is actually pretty good. Which is another thing. Having a super fast Pokemon that also has high defense is like perfect. That will probably knock us though. Yeah. Now, I did, I did realize an issue I have with the Executor. Uh, Executor. Uh, Grass Nut and Low Kick is for the heavier the target, not the heavier the user. Also, I might have accidentally used Low Kick. Yeah, but it should still, yeah, be enough to knock him out. Okay, glad that was a healing round. So we're gonna get Gardevoir back. Oof. Now I should say I'm getting certain things in place for the next Pokemon related playthrough. Um, or at least the next, uh, my RPG through uh, our streams so yeah I should be doing one of those in between here and uh, Contra. I'm probably gonna do it in between one of the Halo games um, and really depending on how the first one goes is probably when I'm gonna figure out my schedule of either going straight through a bunch of Halo games or doing a playthrough in between each one. That didn't knock them out. No, I have the thing that boosts super effective. Alright. Weak to poison. Okay. Seems like Gardevoir might not be the best first choice. Comments. Okay. I think fighting's weak to psychic. Yeah. So this should be a one hit knockout. So we just got one more. Please give me something else that's weak to Psychic. It's possible? I can't remember if Bug is or not, but Steel isn't, so... Great. Maybe they'll use a stat boost. Nope. It's gonna be it for Gardevoir. Alright. And nothing is super effective, but... So sort of steel. Steel pipes are typically heavy. So this should do some boosted damage. Or not. Or we made a... We made a... Great, Mystic Grape. We're gonna have to heal after this, assuming we don't die with Starmie. Also, Starmie does not actually know any psychic moves. Okay. Down. 
We are now as far as we've gotten. I had to go into these last two with just that one. Oh my god, look at this cat. How you doing, buddy? <laughs> Alright, if we can take all of them out with Gardevoir, we will be good for the last round. Does it say it's not crap lot? It's uh, Zor Zoru uh, Zorg. Okay, Zorg weakness. Uh, it's okay. So we should have done Max Starfall. Red card, but I don't think it. it didn't work because I don't know, but they use bug U-turn. Or you just a bug move U-turn. Don't know why I specified it as a bug move U-turn. To see you be careful, you reset my computer earlier when you were on there. Oh, I should have used the fairy move. Okay, it's fine. And we got a crit. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, so we got one more. We're gonna get buffed by hail. It's fine. That's what Queen's weak. And we should move first. So Icy Wind should do this. Yes! Now we're not going to Dynamax Gardevoir because they're low on health, but yes, we are officially the farthest we've gotten on the final round Psychic Spar. <laughs> Bouflant, okay. So doing damage will be good. Try to lower your special defense, and that's gonna knock us out in one hit. Isn't it? Yeah. All right. Now, technically, low kick is probably gonna be stronger than the Dynamax fighting, but. Oh, I just realized, yeah, by the way, I've changed my girl. But, uh, Giga Impact could possibly take us out if we don't dynamize. So, we need to be dynamized. I would assume this Bouflant has the, uh, thing that boosts, going with the Silk Scarf that boosts. Oh, okay, good, good, good. Oh, we should have done low kick. Oh, we should have done low kick. That's alright, with the pack boosts. Should work. Oh, are they healing a little bit? No. Okay. But they're defense boosted. Okay, so that's gonna cancel each other out. 
Oh, but that damage recoil. It should do it. Yes. No. What? Okay, we need to get some grassy terrain for health. What? It it eats grass moves. Okay, that would have been good to know. Damn it! That might do it. Oh no! Damn it! We did not make it this far to lose. Starman, it's up to you, bruh. If we just did the overgrowth. <sighs> okay, one down, two to go. A toss. Okay. Wish I had some psychic. Moves. All right. should be able to knock them before that comes into play. What's that do again? Does that boost your special defense? It does. It does. And your wish game shoe. Great. Damn it. It's a crit. This was a terrible one to put in the last round. Breeze, please. Breeze, please. Do it. One HP. There's no way. There's there's no way. Freaking blech. If I didn't make that one mistake with Exit, then they would have been able to probably take out that Pokemon. Did I switch the music? Something's... <laughs> is it trying to signify that this is going to be the last... Uh, last round? Again, but the 
chance that doesn't. There we go. So close. Trick room. Okay, so it's gonna get it speed up. Or not. Alright, we should be able to take it out. It's the chef ball. But... Okay, a little confused. But okay. I really should figure out what Trick Room does. Oh yeah, all your other Pokemon are fainted, so... Okay. Um, so it creates Bizarre Area and then inverts the turn order. Oh, okay. So it doesn't actually increase speed. It makes whoever's slower move first. Okay. What's gonna be strongest? Um, let's use let's use Max Geyser. Oh, get rain, and then be able to use another Max Geyser to finish it off next turn. So we'll probably be two hits no matter what, and then this will boost our water for the last one. that to bring you from down. Nope. Would have killed you if I had used Hydro Pump. Okay, so here's the question. What's your health? I think our health is in the yellow. So we should heal. We should heal. Let's just hope round three doesn't make us heal.
It might. show as much. I'll cover it up for close. But right here, um, what's my finger is on top of right now. Uh, it's from a cat trying to get down from my desk um, while also being on my arm. So I do have a scratch um, that looks worse than it actually is. It's not going to do much. Well, if that's the most they can do, then we should be good if we can one-shot the final. Then... Yeah, we won't need to heal at all. We've still not faced any annoying Pokemon yet. So we're not going to be able to one-shot them. We might, with the terrain, be able to two-shot them. They're faster than us. Ooh, and they're strong. Use a stat move for no reason. Damn it. It's faster than Red War, of course it's going to be faster than the next one. Damn it, we're going to need to heal. I should have just picked Star Moon and done Venom Bolt. Alright. First, though, um, is that gonna up your special defense? Yeah. Damn it, that was enough. That was enough to save him. Future Sight, hooray! So we essentially have to two turns. I don't think we can take you out on hit, can we? Barely anything. That 
might do a sin. Oh. Okay. I'm always confused on who's wicked can sink. Alright, I got one more Pokemon. And the light screen's gone. Okay. Alcream might explode. But they'll use Fick Tears to lower our special defense. Good. Save card. Okay. We might be able to knock them out before they blow up. Oh, thank God. Oh. Okay. We've got one more round. We've got all three Pokemon. Gardevoir is above half health. And they sent out Clef. Which I think is weak to one of my moves. Alright. That is not the case. I might be weak to one of theirs. Do I want to Dynamax? We're gonna save it. We're gonna save it. Yeah. Okay. I hate to say it, but that is technically worth it. That's what that did. It's got them down to half. And we're able to Dynamax and take this Pokemon out in one hit, getting us back on the even footing. And if they use that move again, we're not weak to steal, so we should hopefully survive that move for Gigantamax. And also, um, they should knock themselves out. But we'll knock them out with Max Geyser instead. which lets the rain start happening. So hopefully, if there's any other Pokemon that are weak to water, they will be knocked out in one hit, like Volcarona. All right, we got one more Pokemon to deal with. Please don't be double. Seismic code, okay. You're not weak to anything I have, but water is still effective on you. Except for the fact that it's not, even though it says it is. Okay. But they are super weak to grass, so let us try to I mean all we can use is ice beam. So let's just keep doing this. Maybe we'll freeze them. But at the very least, we can get their damage. Oh, we're weak to poison, aren't we? No, we are not. Okay. Are those? And they'll be in yellow. As long as this doesn't crit, we should be good. Right. Rain stopped, which is good. Okay, you did good, Starmie. You did good. Alright, Executor. Let's finish this off. Now. Okay, still has the power. Let's do this. Come on. Come on.
Yes. Oh gosh. That definitely took the longest out of all the spars. But we did it. Okay. Completed the restricted sparring with all types? I can't believe it. Oh, we need the right to wear this outfit. And we got the mustard tea. Alright, let's go check that out real quick. Nope. Gonna be switching back to the one I had. Or I guess I could keep it out of change. There we go. Okay. So. Now. Uh, so we don't have to change our team. Let's just go ahead and fight her. And this, similar to some of the trainers in Let's Go, is a daily event. I believe Mustard is as well, but we've already faced him on stream, uh, post-game. We'll be able to wipe her pretty quickly. She's weaker than Mustard. I'm getting a thing out for end of stream. Protect, that's cute. Gonna send him to die. Tech, that's cute. <laughs> okay. Slowbro might be able to take us out. So they're gonna Dynamax. And they'll have a poison, which would be a deal. So it's possible. Still with the level gap, not highly likely. It's time to do the last battle of the stream. So let us get our team set up. First, let's put these items back in our bag. You guys did good. Training was worth it. Next, 
it's time to get our team of six. So we get in bar. Uh, and then we're going to be looking for the rest of them. We want to get spears. Unfortunately, not uh, at this time. Where is... Uh, where is any of them? Any of my main? There. We're gonna have like in our team from now on, replacing Phalanx. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Phalanx was gonna be permanent. Uh, but Lycanroc, Shiny Lycanroc, way better in my opinion. Uh, and to be fair, uh, Falling's replaced Lucario, which honestly, oh wait, this is an open Lucario? What? Who are you? World 08. Oh, you must be from the Mystery Gifts. Okay. There's too many to go through. So I used to have Luxray on my team. And to be fair, if I go ranked, I'm probably going to use Luxray on my team. Alright, it's not going to be there. But... Oh, I'm really... Today's the day that we all get the shiny Zera Aura. It's probably not live yet. It's probably going to be live tonight. But that's what's going to be on my regular... Right now I have this one. But that shiny is going to become uh, my main. Okay, so next... We need Arcanine. Where, where is Fiera? Fiera. Fiera. I know I didn't move you back to the box, Baria. Sorry. Do you check the mystery gifts again? It's not news. Oh, Dominion. Mystery gifts. Gift box. Yeah, not yet. Okay. Next, we need Bud. Or... No, I still think Toxapec. Um, because... I don't know. Where are they at? Not you. Your evolution. Uh, oh, you're the one from Sun and Moon. There you are. Pat. Now, Pat's only level 78. So. Okay. For now, I'll go with Bud. I remember correctly, he's at the top right somewhere. Alright, so we got our dragon, our rocker, electric, our fire, our water, and then I always forget the six. Uh, 
Shoot. Um, I put on Discord. One of them, one of my really old teams. Um, I could technically add you, but no. I wish you could search for ones that are hyper trained, because then obviously yeah, I would find my other level 100. I mean, there's my ride on. But, like in Rock is kind of also filling with that position. Um, shoot. I wish you could search all conversations. Definitely. Another spot would be here. Oh, oh, no, that's a uh, put I made for my wife. Food. Oh, Frost Moth. That's who it is. Just took a year. Alright, Dora. Damn, that took way too long. But okay, so we've got our team. And really, the only, I mean, Zero will really be switched with Luxray for ranked, um, and Bud for Tux Pack. Let's see, who should we, I mean, Zero War needs to go out first. We just need items. So well, let's give wave incense to Bud. Um, I should have charcoal in here somewhere unless I left it on kit. Oh, uh, like a rock has a thing. Okay. Um, magnet to Zerapora. Let's go with... them can evolve. Prospects now. Charcoal. Okay. That to fair. Faria. Uh, okay. Let's use bright powder on bomber. Lowering accuracy. Um... And then we need something for... Let's get wise glasses to Aurora. Okay. I think we're set for the final battle with Honey.
to share some walnuts on my walnuts. Going right past a million walnuts to celebrate, I'm going to give you the chance to battle the strongest of trainers. Oh, it's... Uh, uh, uh. Have them reach out to some of the region's champions to ask for a battle, but I guess Gamelier is just a bit too hard to come for a friendly pickup match. Alright, so now I'm ready to battle. After this, we just got the Pokedex. Your opponent will be. Wait, what? Wild Dojo? At least Wild's trainer. <laughs> Is she beating him up? Or did she beat him in a poop? Okay. Okay. That's... Hmm. Do this. All right, starting out with Blissey. Okay. What level are your Pokemons? Sixty. Gonna be difficult. Sarah Orr is probably gonna wipe them. This is a bit of a wet end. <laughs> Got my team set up and everything. <laughs>
<sighs> so technically there is another post game thing. Two, three million watts. But it's very minor. Um, and that's a lot of grinding to miss to three watts. I'm not saying I'm not eventually gonna do it, but probably not gonna do it on stream and almost Definitely. I'll be honest, I'm probably. Once I get the Pokedex and uh, finished up, which we'll be doing right after this, and once I get uh, my Shiny Zero Aura, who I will be naming Volt, um, then. Uh, I'm probably not gonna touch Pokemon so well. I say that. I have I gotta write my computer when I started because of the cats. I think got uh, yeah, I got three four more Pokemon to drag the Antimax. And then two of my personal Pokemon that I want to go ahead and check Animax. Alright. So, now we're gonna save. I guess let's talk to Honey, see if anything else popped up. Okay. Okay. So, last thing is the Pokedex. Um, so, if you're just here to kind of see post game stuff, there is technically a reward for completing the Pokedex. Um, so, if you want to stick around and to watch that, you can. Um, it's literally just going to be me going in and out of the daycare. Um, Uh, and then flying back for a thing. But, you know. Oh, wait, not yet. Um, but yeah, so other than that, thank you guys for watching up to this point. And if you would like to see that stuff, you can probably skip to the end. Or, you know, stay and chat with me. I mean, no one's here live, but uh, we'll be chatting. Um, but real quick, I need to list down a few Pokemon. So, let's see, number 003, which I believe is Slowking. Number 11, which would be Igliba. I, I, well, Slowking I saw earlier in the Igglybuff, obviously. Um, number 31. Ambra, number 32, Ambra, 33, Sam, okay. uh, number 75, Will, Will, FT, number 76, Gold. I believe there's 21 or so that I have to do this with. It's gonna take a bit. Number one, two, one, Heracross. Number 134, whatever Sandy Gas evolves into. Uh, I don't have Gold Duck. I could have swore I've caught one in the DLC. Phoenix Cloud. Number 164. Again, I thought I caught a mine shell. Apparently not. Number 69. Sand 
Flash. Number 178. Crucodile, I think is its name. Number I. Okay. 187. Corona. The shiny that it's showing is my the one in my box. <laughs> um. All right, those two I don't know. Number 194. Number 195. Uh, number 200, Kingdra. And that is the list. So let's figure out what 194 and 195 are. Thank you, Cerebi. And technically, um, 200. Oh, wait, there's two missing here. Uh, number 209, Porygon 2. Number 210. Or, uh, Z. And then technically the root is in this dex, but they've not been implemented in the game yet, so they are not needed in the group. Alicia. 194 and 195 are Sprell. And Dragail. Alright. So now I gotta put all these folks into the Pokemon Center and then bring them out. Thankfully, you can do it two at a time. Okay, um. Best way to do this is by searching them for them by type. No, not slow bro, slow king. There you are. Watch from the game. And then Higgly Buff is gonna be just. Might be in that box. Nope. Normal fairy. If they're not normal fairy, then they're either just normal or just fairy. They were just normal. I'm Otsi. How you doing, Otsi? They're gonna be just fairy, aren't they? What are you doing, Otsi? Us, I forgot to trade Igweave off. Alright, well, that's all explode. So let's that. Hey, Mutsi. Don't touch the keyboard, please. I don't be touching the keyboard. Okay. Cool. Cool. We're getting period a lot. Good. Good. Thank you. That, I appreciate it. Into box. And let's take X out. Who's a good horseshoe? Alright. So I'd like to leave some Pokemon. No, if are still watching, then congratulations! Um, so when I said I was working on the next, uh, setting up the next Pokemon related playthrough, and then specify the RPG playthrough, what I meant was that I am going to go ahead and do the Let's Go post stuff that was requested while I was playing it. Um, but I had literally come off my own personal place. I okay, I did not transfer a bleep off. Um, okay. So I'm gonna have to catch my raid. Well, well I guess I'm gonna have to breed it. 
Um, okay, so let's go with the Alicate Sam one. Um, but yeah, so how I'm going to do that is I'm going to go back on my McFox account and do all the post game there except for the battle with Red. Um, and I'm still not going to do all the master grants, uh, because that would just take too long. It would require 153 Pokemon, which I had at a time in that game, um, but don't anymore. Now, let's go down the line of what there is in the post game. There is. Uh, catching Mewtwo, which will be the first thing we do, um, and then right after that we'll be battling Green, which happens in the same spot. Uh, let's see, we need to find the Alakazam. Oh. Alakazam. There you are. And then Whirlipede. Uh, I don't know, it's secondary. Dude, I might have also forgotten to transfer one at the beat. Oh, there they are. Okay. I need to check that I have Igly buff now. Um. So, catching me to battling green. Uh, then you, we are going to battle the Elite Four again, so that we can do the final green battle. Uh, then, uh, we'll battle Blue, um, again, as he is the new gym leader in Viridian. Um, and we might do that first before Mewtwo, actually, because the wise. All right, that's the one that I'm just not sure of its name. That, those three, okay. Pokemon. Number. Alright, I'm making sure I have Igloobuff, because if not, then I need to rerun it. Yeah, I got two in Pokemon Home, so I just forgot to transfer. Um, I need to take my Pokemon back, please. Um, so, battling blue. Then, apparently, you can battle Archer again, who, if you don't remember, is the Pokemon, uh, the, the Pokemon, the Team Rocket, new Team Rocket member. Um, so we'll be doing that, and then Jesse and James are on Route 17, we'll be doing that battle. Um, we'll go ahead and do the Mina battle, which is a daily battle, um, but similar to battling the, uh, antagonist character in, in the DLC. It's just something to do. <laughs> um, and then after that... That's everything we're going to do in the McFox save. Uh, minus the Sand Slash. Then let's Crocodiles here. They are not. Okay. Uh, so let's look up. Around. There you are. Um. So once we get all that done, which honestly we could probably get done in one stream. Um, and could probably do, like, now. Um, we are going to go into my personal game, of which I have just transferred 
five Pokemon that thankfully are, were able to be transferred back. Into there. Um, which I believe I've gotten five Master Trainers done. I've either gotten five or six. Um, but I've still not done the Red Battle. That's what we're going to do uh, as the final thing is fighting Red on the Indigo Fight Hill. Um, so let's see. What's left? We've got Gold Duck. Oh, Corona's not in there. Corona's got to be near this box. Because they were a bug. What the hell? Alright, well, I see the crocodiles. It's that one. Um, but yeah, so that's what I'm planning to do, and so when I say I'm preparing, um, essentially got two level 100 Pokemon, uh, which is my Pikachu that can't leave the game, and then my Dragonite that was from Go transferred to Let's Go, and I actually hit level 100, was one of my main six in that game. Um, thankfully I never transferred it here. And I say thankfully because that let me transfer it back. Um, so let's see. You know, I don't. Are you in the Pokedex? Maybe. Okay. Um, so we got these two. Let's look far and get hair across and with Corona. Which we use hair across for fighting, so they should be around here as well. There's hair across. Blitz. Volcarona. There you are. All right. Um, but yeah, I'm excited to be able to do at least two parts of Let's Go to actually finish it. Um, other than, of course, the three master trainers which that's asking a lot <laughs> that's asking a lot um all right don't have too many more let's let's get the port on so that should just be under are they normal or are they psychic than Igly Buff, who we're going to have to do something. Um, let's see. What is Scrub? I know Water. Is Water wrong? Well, once I find Scrub, they should have their in the same box. Again, assuming I actually trade them. 
I might need to do a trip with Pokemon now. One Pokemon I can breed. Three Pokemon. It's faster to just go with it. There's Kingdra. One last check. No. What is Scrow? What is Scrow? Scrow's poison water. I forgot your shiny. It's one of the ones I traded for way back when. Alright. And. What box am I in? Make one last check for eight wave of eight wave. Normal fairy. to do is what? Ah. Okay, so it's only for it's it's all I can be rooted, so let's put in um Let's put in a squiggly. Give them. Bring the this guy back. No. Where's Dale? Just need to ride around a little bit before that egg comes out. So let's just get some lots. I usually will just ride up here. I'm getting lots right now, but I usually just ride up here and then go back and forth a handful of times. I think like three times. We'll usually get the egg. It might not even do that much. 
it might already be there. <sighs> yep. All right. Oh, not what I meant to do. Shoot. I needed it in my party. Now we're just gonna hash this bitch. So actually, since all we have to do is hatch it, why don't we go ahead and go back here? Or just right around here until it hatches. And then that will be the Isle of Armor Pokedex completed. And uh, the, the train stations where we get them items. And then we will check out what all that looks like. But yeah, the Isle of Armor has been pretty fun. Sparring has been, you know, sometimes it's good, sometimes it's uh, infuriating. But all in all, it was definitely more of a challenge than the Battle Tower. Um, which was nice. It, it got me to look into the battles in a way that I haven't in a long time. Um, but yeah, so... Uh, once we're done with Halo 1, I plan on doing Let's Go stuff. Um, and pretty much, I've got like 80... Rare candies are ready. Let's go. Uh, in my personal favorite, let's go. Um, and for all the other battles that we're gonna do, we really just need our Pokemon around level. Oh, eggs already had it. We really just need our Pokemon around level 69, 70. Um, it's a blue buff. Alright, so that should be 210. Yeah, 210, 210. Alright. So let's go back to the train station. Completed the Isle of Honor Pokedex. I want armor that's made this accomplishment be celebrated by all. So now we have the gold crown. We're not gonna wear that because it looks ridiculous. Mark charm. I'm gonna see what the uh, a mysterious and unique item that increases the chance of finding a Pokemon with a mark. What does my charm? My charm is marked Pokemon. Uh -huh. So many 
variants of different types of special Pokemon, the rarest of them all being shiny. Pokemon with a special color variant. Every Pokemon has a shiny version, but the chances are count. Ba -ba. Marks are a neat feature that bring along more personality for each. So, according to Cerebi, there are. From time to time, you will catch a Pokemon that has a certain mark on it. This mark acts like a ribbon. Uh, let's see, there is one added effect. You have the. Means when you throw a Pokeball with the Pokemon and call it into battle, you will have a special attack line. Oh, okay. So. It's just a little... Oh, that's cool. That's cool. I'm glad I got that, but definitely won't be looking to... To, like, use that everywhere. Um, and then she put something on our lead card. So, a second Pokedex complete. <sighs> Let's go ahead and save. Nearly 140 hours put into this game, and to know that we're not done, we've got the Crown Tundra later on. I might still be Watt hunting, Shiny hunting. Um, I really should do ranked battles. And I've still got some Pokemon to Gigantamax. But for now, that's everything. And as you can see, let's go Pikachu is set again i'm not set for that simply because i don't have any pokemon that are level 85 well you know what let's see i'm gonna cut the stream the highlight here but i'm gonna check real quick the let's go pikachu stuff mcbox so thank you guys for watching and i will see you next time